More than 1.2 million people in the United States are living with HIV. The CDC reports one in eight of them don't know it. And if you are high risk for HIV, you should really consider this as an option. We'll need to get some baseline labs on him. Chris McVeigh is chief medical officer for One World Community Health Centers. She's talking about this medicine. Pre-exposure prophylaxis um, is a medicine that you take before you have HIV in order to prevent HIV infection from happening. The CDC estimates that the more than a million people in the country who are at high risk for HIV infection, less than 5% are taking the pill. In the Metro, experts say there are around 200 active prescriptions. Pre-exposure prophylaxis as a medical tool is not anything new. Um, when people travel overseas and they get a malaria shot, that's the same thing. That's pre-exposure prophylaxis. That you're going to an area where you know you would be at higher risk for contracting malaria, so you get a shot beforehand to protect you. Uh, PrEP uh, for HIV is the same thing, except it's just taking one pill a day. The medicine prevents the virus from entering the body and causing an infection. In many cities, um, San Francisco, New York, larger cities, I think the word is out more and people know that uh, this is a great tool for preventing HIV. Experts are trying to push awareness here in the metro. That's one of the things that we do at Kohl's is we offer the testing and prescribing for this particular pill. Without an HIV vaccine on the horizon, Kohl's Pharmacy does what it can to educate on preventative options, and this pill is one of them. We are hoping that this is going to be the beginning of our goal, which is the first generation free of HIV. So we are hoping, and all of the results show us, that pre-exposure prophylaxis is keeping people safe. In Omaha with photographer Jim Hinchick, I'm Brian Mastery reporting, WWT 6 News.